Breaking news in the verdict in the wrongful death civil trial of Corinne Gaines. The family awarded tens of millions of dollars. WJC is live at the circuit courthouse in Towson. Rick Ritter has breaking details for us. Rick? Well, Vic, this is certainly a bombshell announcement. The family of Corinne Gaines has been awarded 37 37 million dollars. Most of that money going to Cody Gaines, 32 million to be exact. We just heard from the all female jury a short time ago when they put their verdict in. They found that Officer Ruby's first shot, the very first shot that he fired from outside of Corin Gaines' apartment, was not objectively reasonable. They say the defendants violated Cody's rights, Corin's rights, and that they both committed battery against them. We just heard from the family and the attorneys a very short time ago. It was extremely emotional. The family saying that we had a dream team of attorneys, but saying this isn't enough. They want Officer Ruby fired. Here's what they had to say a short time ago. We're ecstatic. This was a long journey to justice, a lot of hard work, a lot of sleepless nights, phone calls, one, two, three o'clock in the morning, like it was one, two, three o'clock in the afternoon. The jury did their work. They came up with a verdict that they believed was fair. They came up with an award that they felt was just. And we don't have anything else to ask. Again, $37 million awarded to the family of Corin Gaines after this verdict has come in. Just to give you a quick breakdown, that's $300,000 for the estate, $300,000 for mom, another $300,000 for dad. 32, 32 million dollars awarded to Cody, 4.5 million dollars awarded to Corinne's daughter Carson, and you just heard from Jay Wendell Gordon right there. He also added that Officer Ruby, he called him a very sick individual, an evil person. And again tonight, the family and Jay Wendell Gordon, the other attorney Ken Ravenel, all calling for Officer Ruby to be fired. Live in Baltimore County this afternoon. I'm Rick Ritter reporting for WJZ. Okay, Rick, thank you very much. Of course, WJZ will continue to follow reaction to the verdict and bring it to you.